and hello everybody. My name is John. Welcome to another edition of the old Zone One Beer Club, and I'm bringing you a one the night that we had last night during the beer club. We have beer club every Thursday and uh, Saturday, and uh, drink some big craft beers. Well, we had a uh, very uh, strange one last night, and uh, I got an opportunity to. Uh, get an extra of it so I wanted to do a review on it because there's no reviews whatsoever on this beer so the old Zone 1 Beer Club is bringing you the first of its kind in the YTDC what we're looking at tonight is nope it's not your father's root beer it's not your mom's apple pie oh yeah 5.5% ABV and I'm going to tell you what, guys, it ain't your mom's apple pie, because it's really apple pie. Let's crack her open. We're not going to drink this to straight from the bottle. We're going to pour down the old only in the zone one glass. So I want everybody to see what it looks like. Ah, not your mother's apple pie. See what it looks like. Bring it to you right there. A lot of carbonation. Not much head. It dissipated pretty quickly. But let's talk about this really for what it is. I mean, uh, all jokes set aside, you know, I, I kind of like to have fun with it. But, I mean, you, you take these beers like this to me. These aren't what I would consider a beer. It's not what I would really consider a craft beer. This is more of a novelty type beer. Uh, that is selling off the shelves as fast you can get. There's a new one out now. I'm going to try to get this weekend, uh, which is uh, Strawberry Rhubarb, which uh, I will have it, and I'll do a review on it sometime first of the week, if not Sunday. But uh, we had this last night, and we was kind of analyzing it, trying to break it down a little bit on what we thought the apple pie taste was. Because it does pretty much taste like apple pie, smells like apple pie, don't look like an apple pie. But, I, you know, I'm a big fan of McDonald's and, and my buddy Robin, uh, God love him, he said, you know what this tastes like, a McDonald's apple pie. And, you know, after drinking, I, I got me another glass full and I thought, wow, man, it is. That is a McDonald's apple pie. Kudos to to you guys for making something taste like a McDonald's apple pie. It's just got that right amount of bam to it. It's really enjoyable and it's great. And you know, I, I don't think it's in a lot of areas right now. Uh, first time I've seen it, you know, uh, was was yesterday. Uh, it, it is in Louisville right now, and I think. It's in Louisiana because I think Jay said something last night that it's in a warehouse down there where he works, so it may be in Louisiana. But, but you know, I mean, this these are novelty beers, and, and I can't look at them any more than than what than than a novelty beer. They're great. They're fantastic. I've had the Night Father's Root Beer. I've had them all so far. I've had the 10.9% uh, Night Your Father's Root Beer. I know they make a 20% which I think is maybe only in Chicago. Uh, i love to try that because it's only on draft. But I'd love to have one of these on draft. But, uh, you know, I mean, you, you get what you get with these beers. And wh when you rate these type of beers, you got to rate them for what they are, uh, a novelty-type beer. And uh, But, you know, overall, they've done a good job on this beer. It's, it's fantastic. And I hope if you enjoy these type of beers, that you're going to jump all over the bandwagon and, uh, you know, go out and get them. I mean, they're kind of expensive. They're not over expensive, but, you know, you're getting a six-pack around nine, ten bucks, depending on where you're at. Uh, they might be cheaper. They might be higher, but around here, nine, ten bucks in the, in the Louisville area. So, But you get all that, that little bit of that cinnamony apple. You get the pie taste. You get, you get it all. I mean, <clears throat> they've done a good job. 
I'm gonna say their their R and D department has got to be tremendous. Uh, their brewers have got to be tremendous because they're putting together some spot on type beers when, when you're looking at beers like this. You know, I know they're not for everybody. They're not gonna be for. They're not meant for everybody. But for people like me that you know that take a look at beers like this and take a look at other profiles of beers like this, you know what I mean. You know, if you're going to rate it one out of five, uh, I'd be all over giving this a four. Pretty easy. It's pretty hard for me to give it a five, but I would give this a pretty pretty solid four. Saying that is, I'm I'm examining the beer. I'm examining the taste, the smell, the appearance for what it is, and and for what it is. It's good. I mean, there's nothing you can compare this to because there's nothing out there to compare it to. I mean, that's simple. When you're looking at these, uh, you've got to look at it for what they are because where are you going to go find another nice, nice mother's apple pie at? There's nobody making that. So you got to take a look at this and, say that, and, and look at the broad spectrum of it and say there's nothing out there like this. So what am I going to classify this as? as a one through five. Pretty solid four because it's it's pretty good. I mean, if you like apple pie, I really enjoy my grandma's apple pie. But you know, I mean, it's good. It's fantastic. It tastes like that cinnamony apple pie taste. And it kind of tastes like the McDonald's apple pie. And uh, I'm a big fan of McDonald's apple pie. Hell, I'm a big fan of McDonald's. I don't know if you've had the Grand Big Mac yet, but thumbs up to the, you guys. Hey, you know what? I hope they sell the baby Big Mac for breakfast because, you know what, that'd be awesome. But uh, that's my goal in life to have a McDonald's franchise. Not really. I like doing woodworking. So, but, you know, I mean, uh, yeah, I mean, if you can find it, get this bad boy. Be all over it. Try it. You know, not your father's. But hey, this is not your mother's. And it's awesome. Look at that. Apple pie right on the front. You know what? I'd like to try this in about 10.9 or maybe 20%. Because, wow. What a freaking apple pie that would be. I'm John. The Zone 1 Beer Club. And you know what? Get it, try it, taste it, score it for what it is. Double thumbs up from the beer club. I'm John, and you know what? I'm out of here.